In this video I'll show you how to make a Bluetooth controller to control your AC appliances with your smartphone and build an app using the MIT App Inventor. The controller can measure temperature and give live report on your smartphone. Without further delay, let's jump right into it. Wake up Jarvis! The star of the circuit is this Bluetooth module which receives data from your smartphone or any other Bluetooth compatible device and performs a task as far as your program. The list of the component for this build is a bit long, but you can find the part list, code and other important details in the description below. At first, I measured the dimension for the AC socket, the switch and for the two LEDs which will be later act as indicators. Then I transfer the measurement on the enclosure. I went with this small enclosure with a length of 10 cm, breadth of 6 cm and a height of 2 cm. It is actually pretty small. After that, the rough outlines were made and cut using a rotary tool. Then I immediately fixed the AC socket and the main switch to it. After that, I drilled another 8mm hole for the mains wire to feed through. Moving on, I shoulder the mains wire to the step down module which converts our AC signal to DC signal which will act as a power source for all our module such as the Arduino, Bluetooth and the relay. Then I glued the module using some hot glue followed by the relay module keeping a distance of 1.5 cm in between for the main switch to sit. Now connect the manual switch in parallel with the relay. By this time you might have spotted the difference that I have changed the switch just because it's a bit smaller compared to the other one. Now connect the mains wire parallel to the AC socket while putting the relay module in between, that is in series with the socket. Now for the control electronics, I'm using this Arduino Pro Mini because of its small size. Then I shouldered two female jumpers for the transmit and the receive pin of the Bluetooth module and connected all the wires as per the schematic. Now shoulder the RGB LED only using the green and blue LED while trimming the red leg off. Then I place the NTC temperature sensor through the analog pin 5 with respect to a 10 kilo ohm resistor which was then connected in a voltage divider format where the middle pin goes to analog pin 5 which to the other end plus 5 volt and ground respectively. Now it was time for uploading the code. I used a TTL converter for uploading the code. Whenever a on button is pressed on the app it sends an integer value of 1 and for off it sends an integer value of 0. Once the code was uploaded, it was time to give a test. Connect the Bluetooth module to the board and power on the board. Once you know everything is powered successfully, open the app and start controlling. Now that we are talking about the app, I use this MIT App Inventor software to design my own app. The link to the app is in the description below. Now it was time to pack everything up. I used a lot of hot glue to fix the Arduino and the Bluetooth of the top surface of the enclosure. One thing to be noted here that due to the lack of internal space, I had to skip the main switch and fill that hole using a plastic feet. Then I closed it all up, placed the board somewhere on the wall. Now I can enjoy turning all kind of AC appliances using my smartphone and it kind of feels awesome. So if you like this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. In the end, thanks for watching.